Congress. <laughs> Uh, the power of attorney is an instrument granting someone authority to act as agent or attorney, in fact, uh, uh, for the grantor. Yes. <laughs> uh, letter of an attorney, warranty of attorney, warrant of attorney. Yes. Mm -hmm. Now, this legal ability to produce a change in legal relations, doing whatever act are authorized. Yes. They have what's known as the, the durable power of attorney. Yes. And then the general power of attorney. Yes. The irrevocable power of attorney, the power of attorney for health care, the advanced directive, yes. And uh, the springing power of attorney, yeah. Mm -hmm. Now, I know that each and every one of the employees of the United States have to put their assets in a blind trust, yes. And that means that somebody, yes, has a durable power of attorney to act on your behalf without your knowledge, yes. That means all the bank accounts that you had before you got appointed or elected to office, yes, they all have to go into a trust. Now, I'm going to need to know the actual signatures of the irrevocable power of attorney that is enforced during the time that you're in office. Mm -hmm. Because I'm sure the president did not have any time over the last three years to manage his own assets or to spend any money outside of the annual salary that you receive as president of the United States. So you're making deals. Pooch. Well, the art of the deal is not to move embassies. Yes. Now, I do have the actual power necessary. Yes. See, the Powell Doctrine, the Corrupt Motive Doctrine. Yes. Yes, yes. Why don't we look at the Doctrine of the Corrupt Motive? Yeah. I had mentioned the United Nations um, or, uh, International Convention of Corruption. Yeah. And I'm saying, well, you're not practicing law, yes, as an appointed uh, court commissioner when you don't enforce the requirements of law and you don't do what the court rules say, yes. And you said, no, we can do it because the guy's crazy and we're just going to do it because it's in the best interest of the women and children, yes. But this whole idea of corruption, oh, I know. You say I'm homeless. I document lawsuits every day. Well, you're going to obstruct my use of the of, of the judicial system. Mm -hmm. You're going to keep my sons in the wrong grades, and then you're going to be corrupt because of that. the unlawful or depraved motive. Yeah, given to dishonest practices such as bribery, oh, subject to corruption of blood. Yes. Now this is in the corruption of blood is a treasonous act of parliament. Yes. Now, corrupt is to change someone's behavior, morals, or principles from good to bad. Yes. I would say that when my wife decided to go Illuminatist without telling me what she was doing, yeah, she was corrupted. <laughs> she thought she was a porn star when I thought she was a <laughs> good Christian homeschooling woman. <clears throat> now, to change the traditional established form of cultural language, yeah, so that it becomes worse uh, than it was before, yeah. To destroy or diminish the quality and usefulness of an electronic or mechanical vice or its, its components. Yeah. Now, this doctrine of corruption, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, there's the corruption of blood, a defunct doctrine now considered unconstitutional, under which a person loses the ability to inherit or pass property as a result of the obtained or, or being declared civilly dead. Mm -hmm. Corruptly, oh, corrupt, uh, corrupt motive doctrine, yes. The rule that conspiracy is punishable only if the agreement mm -hmm, was entered into with an evil purpose, not merely with an intent to do the evil act. Yes. Originated People versus Powell, which 1875, been rejected by the Model Penal Code. <laughs> but there's the Corrupt Practices Act, or no, I guess not. <laughs> exactly what, uh, what corruption laws are there? Yes. Mm hmm. Uh, depravity, perversion, or taint, an impairment of integrity, virtue, or moral principle, mm -hmm. the impairment of a public official's duties by bribery, yes. Mm -hmm. um, let's see, a fiduciary's or an official's use of a station or office to procure some benefit, either personally, yes, or for someone else, contrary to the rights of others, an act carried out with the intent of giving some advantage inconsistent with the official duty of or the rights of others. <laughs> Now, this uh, corruption of office, yes, and the corruption of the minors, known as the five minors name, the impairing of their morals, yes. 
As much as I know that they're straight A students and they're on winning football teams, yeah, I'm thinking that having them live with an Illuminatus did impair the morals of my five son. Since I can't speak to them, I have to surmise, yes, that when you issued a protection order in 2011 because of the corruption, yes, of impairing my rights as a father, you corrupted my, my minor son's power. They've been stuck with a mother that's an Illuminatist, yes, mm -hmm. decided she'd go the way of the lizard family, Oop. make herself some virtual porn so that everybody could be impressed with their large breasts. Now, um, I know that the best thing that could happen, yes, is you could look at your practice of law. Oop. Because without any proof of service, yes, without the actual reciprocity of the United Nations, yes, without an actual dissolution of marriage being given to me, yes, you have corrupted minors. Poop. Now, I know. You say they're doing fine, but do you really know? Do you live with them? <laughs> did you have to listen to their mother for the last seven years or eight months, or did she just waddle in there into the court and say, I was the evil husband that abused her and her daughter? Yes. And you believed everything she said, poop, without any notice or opportunity to myself. <laughs> now, this corruption of minors, the impairing of the morals of the minors that would have grown up with me, yes, I think I can sue you for X number of billions of fucking dollars right now for not practicing the law mm -hmm. and because of the corruption of not doing your official duty. Yes, because you got paid for a show. <laughs> now, why don't you give me the power of attorney mm -hmm. of each judge and justice of the United States? Yes. I'd like to know who their personal attorneys are. Yes, because I will sue each and every one of them. You understand? You have corrupted the morals of the minors named because you did not protect their civil rights. Yes. And you did not protect their right to have me as custody of them. Uh oh. Now, when you issue a disillusion of marriage where you make up some bullshit that you can't get a hold of me, you sure the fuck could. Mm -hmm. I had the same phone number. Yes. The sheriff's department called me in 2013. That's the same phone number I got in. January 10th of 2012, I had the same phone number. <clears throat> now you're corrupt. Oh, let's see here. President, preserve. Mm -hmm. Will, to the best of my ability, preserve, protect, and defend the Constitution of the United States. <laughs> now, this Constitution, yeah. It does have included in it high crimes and misdemeanors. It has what's known as treason. In fact, I got a copy of it here in my backpack. I'll probably get it out next. Let's say you're president, sitting in office, evaluating your own personal finances, finding it difficult to live on $400,000 a year considering you're a multi-billionaire. Thinking that it's better if you don't run for office again and we're not going to move embassies, are we? You know. Now, as an American citizen, yeah, I could sue you for numerous crimes of using any funds other than the presidential salary. Now, I would think that you didn't have a lot of expenses, but you get to travel once in a while, buy yourself some souvenirs. Maybe your beautiful wife decided to go out and buy some $10,000 dresses, so she always looks good. You know, when you're only making approximately, well, $30,000, $35,000 a year, yes, a few dresses that spend up the whole salary. <laughs> you got to watch your spouse when you're in office. <laughs> if I was in office, I'd invite a beautiful woman that's very unattractive, except I find her attractive. <laughs> I'd say, could you go over and get yourself something nice that looks real nice? <laughs> if your wife spent the fucking money, I'm telling you right now. <laughs>